totally made cotton candy. Did you see that? That was crazy. I'm gonna eat it right there, homie. Can you see that? There's like cotton candy. It on... tastes like the lollipop. It's like lollipop cotton candy. What's up, YouTubians? We got Sean and Tyler from We Are the Davises, Woo! and we came across a, um, a channel, Mr. Hacker, a little while ago, and he did something that was really cool. Uh, where basically he made a paper saw and started cutting through like all different kinds of things. So we wanted to test it out and see if it actually worked. And, oh, yeah. Be careful, my friend. Be careful. Okay. <laughs> so anyway, during the research process, we also saw that Guava Juice, uh, um, one of our favorite channels, just did it recently as well too. So apparently there's a lot of interest out there in seeing it does this really work. So and now we're going to do it. Now we're going to do it, and we're going to do it Davis style. Hopefully we don't cut through the tape. So uh, we're going to show you the process of how we put these like paper cutting discs together with the assistance of my lovely wife, Connie. You notice that perfect hands make perfect circles, so. started here and we're gonna kind of do a progression we have about what seven or eight different things that we're gonna cut yeah. and each one's gonna get better and better and better until we cut the whole house in half it's gonna be awesome I'm gonna get the first one. you're gonna go get the first one okay get our eye protection too safety is key all right I'm scared it's super loud <laughs> it is super loud so the first item you might recognize is a box of graham crackers unfortunately we ate all the graham crackers there is nothing inside there except for grass how did grass get in our graham crackers <laughs> But uh, I'm, now I'm kind of bummed because I really want a graham cracker. But anyways, I guess we still got to make a video. So here we go. Tyler, you want to cut first? Or you want me to cut first? We're gonna take turns. Okay. Look at that! I'm a 
<laughs> so oh my god! That's like little pieces of honey-made graham cracker box right there, baby. Look at that. So tried to kill us. Okay, it is not a fail by any means. Oh, you want to continue cutting? Yes, All right, let's go. All right, let's cut it in half. Let's Unfortunately, I think we ruined one of oh, Connie's God. beautiful blades, so I think we're gonna have to switch it out. Uh, fortunate for us, we have a couple extras, so. Okay, so the next round is a deck of cards. So, it really is a deck of cards. There's all... <laughs> yeah, it's a deck of cards. So, will this cut through a whole deck of cards? What do you think, buddy? I think the cards are gonna fly everywhere. You think they're gonna fly everywhere? <laughs> Okay, well we got eye protection on, so we're good to go. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. One, two, three, let's do this! <laughs> a deck of cards is nothing bad. I had to stop because the blade kind of got shredded a little bit and uh, it looked like there was smoke coming. So if you hear the fire alarm go off, maybe see they're all charred and burnt right there. I got, I got some of the cards. Pretty cool. So I think we're learning a lesson here. Like if you're in the middle of like a major construction project and you run out of blades for your uh, hand grinder, you can just glue some paper together. And you can cut pretty much anything you need. Good. Next on the list, after cutting a deck of cards, I'm pretty sure this isn't gonna be much of a challenge, but we had it, so we're gonna cut it. What are you, ready, Tyler? Yeah. Let's get on it, boy. Let's go for it. I mean, if we did this without like breaking anything, it wouldn't be that much fun. All right, now it's time to get on to the good stuff. So we have this giant, ginormous lollipop. Hmm, that's really good. You should try some. Before I eat this whole thing up, maybe we should cut off a big chunk of it. What do you think? Yes. You ready? Yes. All right, let's do this. We're gonna take like cotton candy. It's totally making cotton it's candy! Making cotton candy. <laughs> that is so awesome! It made cotton candy! It totally made cotton candy! Did you see that? That was crazy! I'm gonna eat it right there, huh? Can you see that? There's like cotton candy. It tastes like the lollipop. It's like lollipop cotton candy. DIY. It's a DIY. Now, I don't know how we would get that to actually stay on a stick, but as you can see, it cut through that like butter pretty much. Oh, there's some cotton candy right there too. Get it. I want it. And there's the piece that we cut out, which is not as cool as the cotton candy, but still pretty awesome. I'm gonna go next. 
So let's cut this teddy bear's head off because he killed a man. We got a ginormous gummy bear that smells. Ew! Mm, he's almost as good as a lollipop. You like But what we're gonna do, we're gonna we're just gonna lop his head off, right? Yeah. Let's see if this works. I'm okay. execution. Ready? He's hit me! A piece of what? The, the bear? Yeah! I don't know how that hurt. Alright, during our first couple of attempts to uh, decapitate this giant gummy bear, pieces of the gummy bear were actually flying off and hitting Tyler pretty hard. So uh, we had to put some gloves on just as a safety precaution and uh, now you're ready to go? Alright, you're gonna, you're gonna pay, bear! You're gonna pay! It's making cotton candy with him too! Oh. Oh, yeah, it's it's tore up, man. And I am totally like just covered in little bits of like gummy bear though. I don't know if it's gonna go all the way through or not. Whoa, look at my fingers. See, that was hitting me. That's crazy. I know, I know. I'm like covered in a tear. They got little pieces of gummy bear brain all over my head. So it was cutting him, and it looked like it was making some more uh, cotton candy. Like so maybe like the heat and the, you know, from the friction of the blade and the okay. sugar is yeah. making cotton candy. I want to rip his head off. You want to rip his head off? Okay, so we're gonna, we're gonna do this the old fashioned way because, uh, yeah, baby, go, go, go. There's our decapitated bear. Next on the list, baby. Woo! Oh no, it looks like something really dangerous is going to hurt and hurt me. I better run. Move, move. <laughs> Next on the list is, uh, that's Cadet Chekhov. He's from the Star Trek uh, reboot. So it's an action figure. He he can move and he can wave and look. He's like, hi, how's it going out there, everybody in YouTube? I'm doing it for the vine, which is dead. Ha 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 ha. Okay, so I don't know why he sounds like Phoebe Herman, but we are ready to sacrifice the doll. <laughs> that's saying, I do know what saying. That's kind of demented, but hey, we just wanted to make sure it would work, and it did. So if there's ever a need to decapitate plastic toys, you now have a tool for the job. Hey, I'm, I'm surprised that you went that easily. Hey guys. <laughs> what did you do? Uh, I might have done this so, but he has a six pack. Right, he doesn't have a head, but he's got a six pack. We. For the grand finale, we're gonna try to cut this ancient cell phone. I don't even know if this one has GPS on it. That's like an old, like one of the first Motorola smartphones. I've used one of those before. Yep, yeah, like I don't even think you can like make these work anymore. They're not even compatible with today's technology. But I had it in my drawer, I took the battery out, and we're gonna see if our paper saw can cut through a cell phone. Hopefully it doesn't catch a fire. That would be cool if it did. What are you talking about? absolutely nothing to the side right there as you can see right there like, I put a fresh blade on and we're gonna try it and see if we can actually penetrate the glass on top so let's give this bad boy a shot here you ready buddy yeah. all right high five for good luck man all right let's do it
it's like melting the glass. forever to keep going all the way through though. So it, it kind of penetrated the glass there. Uh, it looked like it was more of like melting it from where I was sitting. I can't really tell. Does it look like a melt there? Or... Yeah, it, looked, it has like little tiny lines if you guys can see that. Can you see that? I don't know if that's a good angle there. But that's pretty cool. Uh, I don't know if that was necessarily a, uh, a success or a fail, but it was fun to try. No, we might need that for another uh, DIY later. Fine. Yeah, I know, that's a big bummer, but we can't destroy all of our props. Well, we can throw it. Yeah, well, that way we could just. What? <laughs> well, if you're ever in a gunfight, you should probably have this like somewhere over your heart just in case because it is literally indestructible. And you're super. I know, I'm like Superman. That must be made of kryptonite My or something. Turn. My iPhone would have broken half already. This is like insane. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> we just smash it with a piece of metal, so that is awesome. No, maybe we need to stack them like that. Okay, our, yeah, our iPhones would be dead. Indestructible. What? Wow. Wow. Amazing. I bet so it, I bet it'd still work. It probably would. I should put the battery in to see what it does, but. That's all we got. We ran out of stuff to cut. I tried to convince Connie to let me cut the house in half. She said no. I don't think you could. Party pooper. But uh, she did uh, a wonderful job helping us make the blades. Tyler, did you have fun? Yep. Oh, right. well, I can see. That's amazing. Well, thanks for hanging out with me today, bud, and doing this awesome DIY. And I hope you all enjoyed it. Make sure you click that subscribe button. And I don't know if you heard this or not, but if you hit the like button, it actually changes color. What? Best thing I've ever seen. It's awesome. You've got to give it a try. And everybody that's watching this has to try it to prove me wrong. And then uh, share with your family and friends. And then until next time.